An alternative political platform which hopes to end the dominance of the All Progressive Congress APC and the People's Democratic Party PDP in Nigeria has emerged. Known as the Rescue Nigeria Project, NRP promoters of the group unveiled the outfit during their inaugural meeting held in Abuja on Tuesday. Clever TV's Florence Joshua now tells us more. As the name implies, the Rescue Nigerian Project NRP says its mission is to take Nigeria out of its present economic, social and political quagmire that have been worsened by an unending state of insecurity and bad governance. Addressing the opening session, its national coordinator, Dr. Usman Bugaji, blamed the nation's present woes on poor leadership and that the group is on a salvage mission. We must rise to salvage and secure our country and return to the path of progress. It is not going to be easy, it has never been easy, yet it must be done, if only because this mess is unsustainable. Indeed, it is a risky business. For rescuing Nigeria means subduing the cartel that feeds on the world economy, the rent seekers, political opportunists, army of hangers on and praise singers flooding the corridors of power, and not the least, the merchants of violence. In a similar vein, former Kwara State Governor Abu Fatai Ahmed expressed sadness that the inability of the Buhari administration to manage a nation's diversity is responsible for the unprecedented separatist agitation by different ethnic groups. The former governor therefore called for a new template and key criteria Nigerian leaders must have before seeking for any political office. His position was supported by former chairman of the Independent National Electoral Commission, Professor Atahi Rujiga, and a professor of political economy, Pat Uthome. Today, we have an unprecedented level of nepotism and political exclusion that has left the country more divided than ever, as evidenced in the various separatist agitations that are threatening the corporate existence of the country. As a matter of fact, the sweetness of diversities which we should have enjoyed in galvanizing our people into a strong working force have been turned into punchlines and have been latched upon by various political groups that are not concerned about the future of this country, rather a pursuit for their personal agenda. We are obsessed with revenues, and that's why we are fighting each other, starting wars, all kinds of things over sharing, structure, restructure. And I, I, when I hear these conversations, I'm struck about the power of ignorance. Ignorance is a very powerful thing. People are rushing to get what will make them poor. Go through history. No nation, no group of people became rich through revenues. You become rich through production. Among other promoters of the Nigerian Rescue Project are former Cross River State Governor, Donald Duke, a former education minister, Professor Tunde Adeniron, Senator Lee Meaba, Ambassador Nkoyo Toyo. The political movement is to be formally launched in November this year. Florence Joshua, reporting for Clairview Television.